Hi, my name is Mike Durkis with Keto Therm Solutions. Today I will take you through the steps to register and sign in with the new Key2 Smart Access portal. First, navigate to smartaccess.ketotherm.net. For the first 60 days of launch, you will see this modified login page, which allows you to access the older KE2 Smart Access Portal or begin your conversion to the new KE2 Smart Access Portal. We are going to move to the new portal. Click the Register tab. This will bring you to a summary of highlights of the new portal. Click the Join button at the bottom to bring up the new login page. Click on the Register tab. There are three methods to register, using your Google account, using your Apple ID, or the most common method, using an email address and password. To register with Google, click the Google button and you will see Ketotherm's terms and conditions. After reading the document, you will need to click I agree button to continue. Then enter your email and password. You will receive an email verification message to your email address you provided. Click Verify Email. You will see a confirmation message that your email was verified and you can log in. Click Login. Then you are brought to the Portal Setup Wizard. Click Start and this will prompt you for your contact information. Fill in the form and click Next. On the site screen, add your initial site using your current Smart Access credentials. If you have more than one site, you can select Add More and enter them at this time, or select the Next button. The next screen prompts you to set up alert notifications. The phone number from the registration process will appear. Check the box to have alerts sent to that number. Also, for existing sites that are converting to the new Smart Access, all user emails that are connected to the site will be listed, and you can select those to receive alerts. Click OK, then Finish. Your dashboard is ready. You can refer to video 136 for information on first-time login and how to purchase Smart Access licenses. Signing up with an email address and password is also straightforward. It follows the same steps as the Google setup. The process when using Apple is similar. Click the button to sign in with Apple. After agreeing to the terms, you will be prompted for your credentials. If you use two-factor authentication, you will be prompted now. You will be given the option to share or hide email. Then you are brought to the portal setup wizard and the process is the same. As I mentioned before, video 136 has information for first-time login and how to purchase Smart Access licenses. For more information, please visit our website or contact our tech support team.